met in 1954. Um, we were in high school together, and he's originally from he's originally from Santa Cruz. I'm originally from Hermosa Beach, but um, his stepfather was transferred down to Southern California, so we went to the same high school together. That's where we met. So we dated for for I think about three or four years and then we went our separate ways, had our own families, and then got reappointed in 1986. Actually at one of the parties that the Longboard Union had at Harvey West in 1986. And ever since then, we've been together. <laughs> yeah. We did get married in 1989, which we went out to Cal's on our board with a friend of ours who was, um, you, you don't call him a priest, but a man, minister who also served at the same time, and he we had our wedding out in the water. At Cal's Kiki. At Cal's Kiki. When he started shaping boards, it was that was 1954. You started with Belzy, right? He was teaching you. Yeah. And he he actually kept shaping through his whole life, even though he was in the Coast Guard for eight years and was also um, a captain of the Merchant Marines. It's all he, on the floor. He, he, he had his shop, his own shop, under his own logo in 1964 and 65 in Aptos. Then he went on to Florida, right? Yeah. And he was a ghost shaper for what, Ron? No, for Oceanside. Yeah. And then he came back up and shaped for the Mitchell brothers. Ralph Mitchell had a shop that was in the late 50s, and then he went back. <laughs> then he went back down to Florida again. Then went on to Brazil and had his business for eight years down in Brazil. And then 1978, he came back to the states, and he lived in Ventura, and just kept shaping. And then when he moved up here in 1986, he opened up a shop again. There's so much to this, Mike. Yes, I could go. Going, I could go on and on. You know?